Well, the world knows Naomi Judd as a Grammy-winning country music star, but behind the scenes, she faced a secret battle with depression, and Naomi is detailing those struggles in her book, River of Time, My Descent into Depression and How I Emerged with Hope. Naomi, good morning. It's good to see you. Thank you for doing this. You know how some mornings you wake up and all of a sudden there's this big um, juicy pimple on your nose? <laughs> I woke up this morning and I have no voice, so oh. take another little piece of my heart now, <laughs> baby. Well, Naomi, I know you always find your voice and you really have in this book. Mm -hmm. And you really are talking about some difficult years when you fell into a depression. Before mm -hmm. we get into it, I mean, what made you want to write? What made you want to to be so public and, and spill it out? Savannah, I'm trying to start a national conversation about depression and anxiety because I may be just one little country singer right here, but there are 43 million of us out there, 43 million who suffer from depression and anxiety. And I want to let the world know that it's not a character flaw. It's a disease, just like you have a disease of the heart, heart disease, or you have cancer, which is wherever cancer of the lungs. And the pancreas, um, if the pancreas doesn't make enough insulin, you have to inject insulin mm. into the body to get rid of sugar. We don't make enough of the ne good neurochemicals in the brain, serotonin, dopamine, nor epinephrine, three big words. We don't make enough of the good chemicals in the brain. It's a disease. It is not. It has nothing to do with our character. And, and as you write in the book, it kind of seemed to come out of nowhere. In 2011, as I understand it, you had just finished up your tour with Winona, and suddenly, one day, you woke up and everything changed. What happened? Yep. It happens with a lot of people. Sometimes people don't realize they have depression. If you go to my book, it's kind of like a survivor's manual on how to survive depression and anxiety. But I realized I wasn't just sadness, like if you have the loss of someone, the loss of a pet, the loss of a job, whatever. You can go into a temporary depression, but this lasted forever. I didn't get off my couch for two years. You were afraid. Well, I was so depressed that I couldn't move. I wouldn't even brush my teeth. I couldn't get out of my PJs. My husband and my girlfriends and I actually, of course, would come over and I would just go upstairs and lock the door in my bedroom, or they'd come to the driveway and I would just lock the door and stand at the window and look at them. You become immobilized. And then my psychiatrist, um, I finally listened to Ashley and Winona and uh, Larry, my husband, and realized I needed professional help. I was dangerously depressed. You talk in the book about thinking about wanting to commit suicide. Yeah. That's how bad it can get. You get down in this, it's so hard to describe because you get down to this deep, dark hole of depression and you really don't think that there's another minute. It's so horrific, you can't even think about another day. But I got so bad that finally, Larry and Ashley called 911 in the middle of the night and they took me in and that's when all the therapy started. One of the things that happens with depression is throughout our life, and I've had a lot of tragedies, and I talk about that in the book, but you just keep squelching it down, you just keep suppressing it, and all of a sudden one day, if you don't deal with it, it starts coming out sideways. Mm. And in the book really chronicles the genesis of this and what may have triggered it and your efforts to rise to hope, which you do. And Naomi, I, I'm out of time, but I, I so appreciate your candor and your honesty and you being here and you have found the your book voice. book is about hope. It is. River of Time. Available in stores now. And Naomi's going to be back and chat more with Megan in the 9 o'clock hour. Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.